Hey guys. So I realized that I did not do a mid-year update for my products to use up in 2016. I apologize for that. Um, by the time that I was going to do it, it was already past the mid-year. So I didn't get a chance to do it. So I am here now at the end of the year to show you what um, I finished up and um, what I hit my goals on. Um, I will link my um, original two videos up here so you can see them um, I didn't know how to use uh, YouTube uh, I didn't know how to use the editing format so um, I wasn't able to put it in one video um, now I know how to do that so I'm sorry that I broke it up into two videos but anyway I will link those two videos up here um, and some of these I uh, either decluttered um, or I switched out um, for another product because I just realized it wasn't gonna work out. And some products I ended up throwing out. So let me just go ahead and get started because this may be a little long. So yeah. All right, so let's start with the first product. This is the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Spray and Set. Um, I did finish this. Um, I have alcohol in here, so um, I just recycled the bottle. And um, But I did go ahead and finish this for the year. Next product that I did finish up is this um, Shea Terra um, Organics uh, Moroccan Rose Water. And I'm so glad I finished this because I did not like this. This was so heavily fragranced that I just could not stand it. Um, yeah, so I will never repurchase this again. Um, and then the next product I had in a project was this um, Jergens Natural Glow, which I finished up. So we'll not be repurchasing this either because um, I'm just not good at self-tanning. Um, finished up this Bure um, Deep uh, Cleansing Pore Strips. Um, I had this in a project. This is the Neutrogena uh, Clear Skin um, Sunscreen, Face Sunscreen. Um, clear Skin. I always say Clear Skin, Clear Face. Um, yeah, I did not finish this. Um, I'm about down here, I think. Um, I This just leaves me really greasy, and I was using this um, when I was running outside. Um, but I haven't been running outside. I've been going more to the gym. So um, I'm just going to throw this out because it's just, I don't want to keep it. I, I'd rather purchase a new one or a different one. Um, next up was this, um, it's a 10 sample, um, this Miracle Leave-In product. I did not use this. My kids actually use this. Um, this is a little bit too heavy for my um, hair. So my kids have really coarse curly hair, so they use, I mean, there's a little bit down here as you can see, but I can't really get this out anymore. So I, I loved the way this worked on their hair. So thanks to them, <laughs> that is done. Then I finished up this um, Pacifica Malibu Lemon Blossom fragrance, roll-on fragrance, and I did like this. Um, but I'm finishing, trying to finish up another perfume. Next up is the uh, Becca Ever Matte Poreless Priming Perfector. Um, I finished up this primer too. Will not be repurchasing this. Um, this took me a while to finish up um, and it's very expensive. Next product here is this uh, BB Physician's Formula BB Cream Argan Wear, and I'm about halfway or a little bit less than halfway. Um, I don't use foundation or BB creams or anything on my skin, so it's been really hard to use this. I will continue to use this because this was a little bit expensive, so I will, but I don't know. If I don't make much damage to this, it, this may end up being decluttered and thrown out because I just don't, I don't really wear this. So now on to the makeup. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the eyeliners that I finished up. Um, so this is my, um, it's down. This is my NYX, 
This is my NYX liner in um, Jewel, so I finished that up. Okay, sorry, and then I finished up um, a couple of these, actually. Um, <laughs> sorry. These uh, Marc Jacobs liner, this one is in, what is this? In Midnight in Paris. So I finished up one of these. Um, that was just, I just put one in here, but I finished more than that. Cream eyeshadows. Now, for this one, I ended up using my uh, Max, my MAC paint pot in um, Bare Study instead of this one, just because I had made more progress. So I did not use this one. This is the Benefit Birthday Suit. So my goal is to really start working on this for next year because um, these, I mean, it's still creamy, but I need to, it's getting older. So I need to start using this. So this will, this will be um, in one of my projects or something to use up uh, or products that I want to use up in 2017. Okay, single shadows. Um, I still have this um, Victoria's Secret in Starry Eyed. This is a really old um, eyeshadow, um, and I just I repressed it a couple times, but um, unfortunately, this is going to be trashed um, by the end of the year because I just don't feel like using this anymore. It's old. I've rep repressed it. The consistency, the consistency is different now. So, uh, it's time to let this go. And the other eyeshadow that I wanted to use up, oh, I have another one here too, um, is this Essence eyeshadow in Party All Night. And I hit pan on this. Um, but I think this one as well is going to be decluttered. I don't know. I just don't really reach for this. So I think this is going to, um, to go. Next eyeshadow that I have here is my Stila and Kitten. And I have worked on this. Um, I didn't use it up, but I said all in, in, all, in this video, I wanted to use up all these products and I didn't realize, you know, it's really hard to use up these products. So, um, I changed my goal to wanting to hit pan on some of these products. So anyway, um, so this is the, uh, this is the progress that I have made in my eyeshadow, my kitten eyeshadow. So I'm going to continue to use this. I'm not decluttering this because I do like this. I wanted to use up this in uh, some of the shadows in here. Um, this is the Maybelline uh, Sun Baked Neutrals, and I was not able to do that. I did hit pan on this one, so yeah, I didn't. I just have so many palettes that I didn't really focus on that. And then the other um, palette that I have here is this Maybelline in Sunlit Bronze. And actually this is in my um, Pan That palette for this month. So um, I, I've hit pan on this one and I'll, I'm focusing on this one. Um, but as you can see, I haven't like finished it up. I haven't even really touched these shadows. So I'll still continue to work on this. Um, I had my Lorac uh, Perfection in tan, and I did not really focus on this this year. I decided to focus on my Remmel Stay Matte and my rice powder, my Palladio rice powder. So I really didn't touch this, but my goal is to um, um, work on this for this year. I do want to get this powder out of my collection um, for next year as much as I can. Hit pan and work on it. So, okay, so highlighters. Um, I worked on my uh, Becca, what is this, an opal um, that I got in a set. Unfortunately, I can't get this stuff out, but I did. This is considered done. So, um, happy about that and then the next uh, highlighter that I wanted to use up this year was my um, Lil Rock uh, in spotlight and I did have this in my last Sorry, my hair keeps getting in my lip gloss I have the fan on because it's so hot in here 
Anyway, um, yeah, I did work on this uh, in my last project pan and um, I finished all this off and this is cracking so I have to be careful. I, I'm probably gonna have to repress this soon but I'm going to continue to work on this because I really like this highlighter. It's very subtle and pretty. So bronzers. So um, I had the Tarte uh, Park Avenue Princess to that I wanted to finish off and I went ahead and did that. So, and then I had my e.l.f. Um, contouring blush and bronzer, um, and I believe this is in St. Lucia, and I did not finish it, but I managed to hit pan on this. And then the um, other bronzer that I wanted to work on is this um, MAC in Golden Bronzer, and uh, as you saw in my last video in, in the uh, Burnin Through products, I did manage to hit pan, so I'm going to continue to work on these two highlighters to, not highlighters, I'm sorry, bronzers to get them out of my collection. Blush, I had this um, L'Oreal uh, Visible Lift in Peach Gold Lift, and this is what I have. Um, this is going to be uh, thrown out by the end of the year because it's starting to a crumble and it's hard to work with so but I did really enjoy this blush um, it's really really pretty but I think it's time for it to go okay my last two products here are my lip liners um, and I had this lip liner from Rimmel and I wrote it down it's in the shade 049 in natural and it's stuck in the cap so um, wasn't able to I can't get it out I'm sorry um, but uh, it is finished okay and then I have this remote lip liner in enchantment in 070 um, and this is finished as well those were all the products that I put um, to use up obviously I used up more products and um, I will be doing a video at the end of the year to show you all the makeup that I used up and I switched out some stuff. Oh, and the two last things I'm sorry that I forgot to mention in um, in here that you may have that you may see in the um, original original video is my um, bio oil I threw out because it was just making a mess. And I also threw out my or decluttered my precious pearl in sorry. Um, it was a cream pot, so I ended up throwing that out. I'm sorry, I'm just showing you the cream pot. Um, but I ended up throwing that out because I just did not like the color and I it was getting, it was so patchy. So I just ended up throwing it so out. Anyways, you guys, um, that is it. Um, I'm going to be doing a video on um, products that I want to use up in 2017. So stay tuned for that. Um, and I do apologize if I'm kind of behind on videos. Um, this is the only place I can really film and um, I, I, this, I don't have any other time to film and my family just kind of lives in this area so I have a certain a restricted time where I can film. Um, so that's why there's a lack of videos. But I hope you can bear with me on that. And um, anyway, I hope you are having a good day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.